in the previous tutorial we have seen how to create hatch on 3d surface now in this tutorial we will see how to cut that hatch to form a th to give a 3d effect to to that hatch for example i have put here the gravel and star hatch is there so i actually want to cut material like this so how to do do that if you try, we will just switch to conceptual visual style and if we now try to press pull go to press pull and if you try to catch the hatch it will not catch that hatch so for catching that hatch we have to actually explode it so just switch back to 2d wireframe then take explode command from modify explode select the hatch and just enter and after that apply the press pull and take the portion normally you will have to take outside of the rock if you want to do inside then individual uh, rocks you will have to extrude manually so outside portion i will click then i want to cut inside so i will go inside and i will give a depth of 0.05 so this cut is created so we can view that cut in conceptual visual style so here that cut is created so we can move it uh, outside and see it properly we will just move the 3d object outside and here you can view that the 3d cut is actually created on the object so you can increase the depth if you want more depth you can give it more so it will look gone inside more so in this way you can uh, engrave something on the material using hatch suppose same way i want to engrave these stars so for that also you you will have to follow the same procedure so first we will switch back to 2d wireframe then we will explode this hatch so modify explode explode the okay it is already exploded so we will just say press pull then take the portion outside and just go inside and give the depth suppose i want the depth to be 0.5 so it is creating that hatch so here again i will come back to conceptual visual style so here you can see that such a 3d stars has been got has got created on that surface so in this way you can also engrave the 3d uh, hatch on the surface to create the 3d objects so that's all thanks for joining we will stop here